Tonight, the focus on efforts to enhance safety measures on college campuses, especially as campus police departments across our area investigate cases of sexual assault. Good evening to you at 11 o'clock. I'm Mark Mullins. And I'm Nicole Griffin. Now we're seeing more student groups form to take action. They are holding meetings and protests and demanding the administration and campus community do more to ensure their safety. WRTV's Cornelius Hawker visited IUPUI, which has several student movements working to make sure campus feels safe for all. In tune with their students, IUPUI's Department of English devoted their final day of English week to campus safety. I feel like a lot of people don't necessarily know the resources that are available and the resources that we want to bring to campus. Emma Kafka and Michaela Jackson are two of the students who helped lead Thursday's discussion. They know what it's like to not feel safe on campus. I personally always have to kind of watch my back and like kind of hold on to my, like grasp onto my pepper spray whenever I'm walking just because you never know who's going to be out. It's the city, so you know, use a lot of people. And so I think this campus, more than a lot of other campuses, has to focus on safety a lot more. Their group, Jack Safe, which stands for Safety and Accountability for Everyone, has three demands. Number one, Sexual assault prevention through adequate education, along with improving the accountability perpetrators face and more support for victims. Number two, increase mental health resources and affordability for all students. And number three, transparency and stronger ties between IUPUI students and IUPD. Their website lays out how they're working to make all those demands a reality. At this meeting, it was noted Jack Safe isn't the only student-led movement on campus working towards similar goals. I attended a um, one from the Isaac organization, which is Indiana Sexual Assault Awareness Campaign. I um, I attended one of their protests. Since last fall, WRTV has chronicled Isaac and their push for increased safety at IUPUI after a sexual assault was reported to have happened in this stairwell at University Towers. I talked to three of the group's leaders last month. They've taken their message to different campuses across the state. We stand with survivors. We, we, we believe them. Um, they are justified and that the universities need to respond better. All the movements and groups at IUPUI that are addressing campus safety were described as a coalition of sorts. They're working toward the same goals, doing it in their own way, all with the hope of making campus safe for current and future students. If they want change to happen, especially on their campus, that they can initiate it and push and just keep pushing until they see it. At IUPUI, Cornelius Hawker, WRTV.